Hello and welcome to our YouTube channel. What we're going to do today is working with the ball. Hello and welcome. What we're going to do today is working with the ball. With the ball is like that. It's what's written on here 25 centimeters or in American 10 inches. So from here I put a little bit of air in there but not too much. Of course, if you put less air in it, it's a little bit more flatter and then it gives you um, more stability. If you pump it up a little bit more, it gives you less stability so things are going to be a little bit more shaky or like you can work on the stability a little bit more. So it's up to you, it's your choice. Let's start. Let's start directly lying on your back and you have your right foot on the ball and your left foot here you can see that is next to the ball on the mat. So I would like you to press equally two feet down and you're going to lift your pelvis and you're rolling through your spine means articulate and bring it back down. The important part is what makes it interesting you're pressing down with two legs the same. So you really feel how you can engage the back muscles of your legs and your glute muscles. Up and down. Good. And up and down. Let's see how that works with the other foot. Here you can see I'm having this there so hopefully you can see that. And lift and lower. And of course you try to do this exercise as controlled as possible. And let's go for two, up and down. And one last time, up and down. Good, let's go to our next one. I always have this nice transition. I'm placing this one in between my hands and bring it towards me. Because we keep the legs bent, extend the arms. You can close your legs and we are pressing slightly with our hands into the ball. Let's lift our chest and we roll this ball over towards our knees and down. Maybe we can see our knees as the peak of a mountain and we want to roll the ball as far as we can towards that peak and up. And of course you can press down with your palms into the ball to create a little bit more activation in your center. Let's keep our chest lifted. We're going to lift a little higher and a little lower. But we keep our chest lifted a little higher and <laughs> lower. It's not so much fun. Let's continue up and down. And three. There we go. And two. Good. And one. And down. Release your head, your neck. You can look side to side. Good. Same thing. Bring your the ball in between your ankles. And we're going to lie down on one side. Today I chose this one. I would like you to gently squeeze the ball and you're going to lift your legs and lower. And again, up and down. And lift and lower. Let's keep our legs lifted and squeeze it and hold it. Squeeze it with two legs. You know you can see it, but I'm squeezing hard and release. Maybe I'm trying to make it a little faster. Squeeze and release. Three and release. Two. One last time. Uh, and then we come down. Good. Let's swing the legs over to the other side. And of course, we're going to do this ones on the other side. First, squeeze the ball just a bit, lift it, and bring it down. And up. Down. Good. Last time. Then you hold the legs just a little bit off the floor and you squeeze and release. Squeeze and release. Two more times, good, and last time, good, and relax for one second.
Good. Now let's bring this ball. Oh, first of all, we're going to lie onto our belly, and let's bring this ball in between our two hands. If it's not really working with ex the ex full extension of your arms, you can keep this ones also bend the arms. Now, lift your upper body, keep it there, circle your arms, and pass the ball to the other hand. Continue the circle, and behind your back, you're going to switch from one to the other hand again. And switch. And up. you keep your chest lifted. And let's go the opposite direction. Start from your left, passing it over to your right hand and keep your chest lifted. And one last circle. Good. And release. Good. Now, let's go. Come into a seated position, a comfortable position. It can be a cross leg position or the, le the legs are extended. Your choice. And let's bring the ball in between our hands. So elbows are slightly open. We almost done this one with the circle, but we are going to squeeze the ball and re rotate to one side. You can look with your head over your shoulder and you release the tension with your hands on the ball and do the same thing on the other side. Squeeze and twist. And back and squeeze. And good. One last time. Each side and and down. I think there was so much fun with the ball. There are much more ideas what you can implement into your class. But today we didn't have so much time. But if you want to see our next video and you want to get notified when we upload our next ones, go over there to subscribe. And if you can't get enough, go over here and watch the next video. Thank you so much for joining me today. Bye.